Hello everyone. Are you wondering about the Antarctic summer? Let's find out. Antarctica, often associated with its extreme cold and vast expanses of ice, experiences a unique and fascinating phenomenon known as the Antarctic summer. While the continent is typically associated with frigid temperatures and perpetual darkness, the Antarctic summer brings a brief period of relative warmth, extended daylight, and bustling activity to the southernmost reaches of the planet. The Antarctic summer occurs during the austral summer months, which span from December to February in the southern hemisphere. During this time, Antarctica undergoes a dramatic transformation as the sun rises higher in the sky, temperatures rise, and vast areas of ice and snow begin to melt and recede. This period of seasonal thawing and increased sunlight marks a brief respite from the harsh winter conditions that characterize much of the year in Antarctica. One of the most remarkable features of the Antarctic summer is the phenomenon known as the midnight sun. As the Earth tilts on its axis, the Antarctic continent is bathed in continuous daylight for several months during the summer season. Near the Antarctic Circle, which lies at approximately 66.5 degrees south latitude, the sun remains above the horizon for 24 hours a day, creating a surreal landscape of perpetual daylight that defies conventional notions of time and space. The extended daylight of the Antarctic summer has profound effects on the continent's environment and ecosystems. Plants and algae, which lie dormant or grow slowly during the long polar night, burst into life during the brief summer months, taking advantage of the abundant sunlight and warmer temperatures to photosynthesize and reproduce. This sudden burst of biological activity attracts a variety of animals, including seabirds, seals, and whales, which migrate to Antarctica to feed and breed in the rich, food-filled waters of the Southern Ocean. Moreover, the Antarctic summer is a time of intense scientific activity, as researchers from around the world flock to the continent to conduct fieldwork, gather data, and study the unique Antarctic environment. The relatively mild temperatures and extended daylight of the summer months provide ideal conditions for conducting research and exploration, allowing scientists to study everything from ice cores and glaciers to marine life and atmospheric processes. In addition to scientific research, the Antarctic summer also sees a flurry of activity at the continent's numerous research stations and field camps. These remote outposts, operated by various countries and scientific organizations, serve as bases for conducting research, monitoring environmental conditions, and supporting logistical operations in Antarctica. During the summer months, these stations come alive with the arrival of scientists, support staff, and supplies, as research programs ramp up and field expeditions are launched across the continent. The Antarctic summer also offers unique opportunities for adventure and exploration, attracting tourists and expeditioners from around the world who are drawn to the pristine wilderness and breathtaking landscapes of the Antarctic continent. Expedition cruises, guided tours, and adventure activities such as kayaking, hiking, and wildlife viewing allow visitors to experience the beauty and grandeur of Antarctica firsthand, while also learning about its unique ecology, history, and scientific significance. Furthermore, the Antarctic summer plays a crucial role in shaping global climate patterns and ocean circulation systems. As the continent's ice sheets melt and retreat during the summer months, they release vast quantities of freshwater into the surrounding ocean, which can influence ocean salinity, circulation, and sea level rise. Changes in Antarctic ice dynamics and mass balance during the summer season can have far-reaching implications for global climate systems, including weather patterns, sea level rise, and ocean currents. Despite the relative warmth and activity of the Antarctic summer, the continent remains one of the most inhospitable places on Earth, with extreme cold, high winds, and harsh conditions posing significant challenges to human and animal life. As the summer season comes to an end and temperatures begin to drop, Antarctica once again returns to its icy, desolate state, reminding us of the resilience and adaptability of life in one of the planet's most extreme environments. In conclusion, the Antarctic summer is a unique and dynamic season characterized by warmer temperatures, extended daylight, and increased biological activity on the southernmost continent. From the midnight sun and bustling research stations to the rich wildlife and awe-inspiring landscapes, the Antarctic summer offers a glimpse into the remarkable resilience and diversity of life in one of the world's most extreme environments. The goal of this channel is to answer all the questions in the world in video format. After we achieve it, when you search for anything on internet, you will be able to watch a video answering your question instead of reading an article. However, if we want to achieve our goal of answering 1 million questions, we need your help. 
please support us on Patreon by using the link in the description. In exchange, we will feature your name in up to 1,000 videos every single month. Thank you for watching. Please like the video, follow the channel for more related content, and see you later. Goodbye.